Electrically powered call boxes we used at Anderson House in place of the older fangled uh, f uh, wire and bell systems. Um, the picture on the right show, of this slide shows how the long since removed call box may have looked like. And what happened is Madame uh, La, uh, Anderson would push a button it would send an impulse all the way to here, to this call box, which is a surviving one in an English mansion. And the bell would ring, and uh, this little indicator would, would light up or, or would change color, and it would indicate that you were being summoned into which room. So all the rooms in Anderson House were, would have been so identified. Call boxes were great for summoning someone, and, but not for, for, for giving quick instruction uh, verbally. So, in, in, in addition to the call box system, an intercom system was also installed that connected the various parts of the house to the service areas. If you look carefully at this picture of the library, and sadly this doesn't survive today, boo-hoo, but, uh, but you'll notice that there's one of the intercoms above the electric light switches and again the service call be uh, buttons. On this intercom system would have been more buttons that would have also, you could have picked up the receiver and you could have pushed a button and it would have taken you to the kit to the cook in the kitchen or the butlers and you could have said, you know, I want this, I want that, hop to it. One such use, as you can see here, uh, this, this is Western Electric Company. Of course, they, are, um, they, made, they made telephones and all that. And they also made electric appliances. Everybody was diversifying then. And there's Madame calling uh, the cook, perhaps to ask um, to order up something special uh, to serve her friends uh, for a luncheon. The, ad the advertisement um, proclaims having such a system was, quote, a necessity in a very well-managed home. So I'm sure Mrs. Anderson's home was very well-managed indeed, uh, because there were no less than 19 interphones within the house. However, interphones were not only used to summon servants, they were also used as extensions to receive outside calls, which would have been switched to an interphone by the butler from a central switching um, telephone area located near the, the central staircase.